Welcome to Raise the Dead, the game contestants are dying to play. And where we resurrect the ghosts of game show pilots past. Now meet your mistress of cemeteries, Elvira. Hello, darlings, and unpleasant treats. Tonight we've got a special treat that'll just slay you. A marathon of game show pilots that got the axe before they ever reached the air. These are shows that have never quite seen the light of day, just like me. <laughs> Unfortunately, some of my favorites, like Name That Goon and Wheel of Torture, were just too horrifying for tonight's screaming. I mean, screening. But trust me, the ones we have are scary enough. Plus, we'll have loads of fun answering questions about each show, which is more than I can say for the victims. I mean, contestants behind me. <laughs> ah! Okay, ready, boys and girls? Our first show is a nice little game of lying and deception from 1972 called Cop Out. It features Bill Bixby, Michelle Lee, Richard Dawson, and Della Reese before she was touched in the head. I mean, uh, by an angel. <laughs> now, listen up, because here's our first Raise the Dead question. Which two players co-starred on that landmark comedy series, Hogan's Heroes? I'll be back later to see if you paid attention. Better get it right. Or else. Ah! Huh, I mean, especially the ones on the men. Now, if you dare to uncover your eyes, you'll know the answer to our Raise the Dead question that I posed at the start of the show. Let's see if our captive audience here was listening. Mrs. Plink? Which two cop-out players co-starred on Hogan's Heroes? Was it Larry Holvis and, and Richard Dawson? <laughs> Correct! Ah! Hey, she got it right. Well, why'd you shock her? Duh, because here at Raise the Dead, there are no winners, only losers. How do you think you got here? <laughs> Now prepare for something even more shocking. Our next game show pilot where John Ritter and Robert Urich go head-to-head. -head. Ouch! Sounds as painful as it is to watch. 